connecting the waterfront. And uh, this doesn't happen through government. This happens through people. This happens through grassroots organization. Government can play sometimes a helpful role, and sometimes it can play an unhelpful role uh, in achieving these goals. Uh, but it's the people, it's grassroots organizations like this, it's leadership like Ron Hine that really makes us actually connect the waterfront in a meaningful way. And I really want to pay homage to Ron because Ron has been here for decades and unflinchingly for Hoboken, unflinchingly for a waterfront unflinchingly for connecting the waterfront, and he does it modestly, with humility, and with vigor. And that's what the, the, that's the advocacy we need. So thank you very much, Ron. We appreciate it, appreciate it. So, you know, as, a, as a local mayor, you know, we, we have to, as electeds, take a cue from the people who might know a little bit more than us and have, might have a little bit more experience than us on these matters. And I've had the benefit of having to have meetings to listen to the ideas of Fund for a Better Waterfront, uh, to their goals, and working with them to th achieve those objectives. Needless to say, right now at the forefront of my mind is Union Dry Dock, acquiring that property, and trying to acquire that property this year. Trying to acquire that property this year. I also want to pay homage to uh, Sam Pesson, I think he's here. Thank you, Sam, for your advocacy. You know, you're not a Hoboken resident, but you're an honorary Hoboken resident because you believe in the same things that Fun for a Better Waterfront believe in. So we, this is a multifaceted project uh, connecting the waterfront uh, all the way from the Hoboken Terminal to the Sinatra Walkway to 4th and 11th Street, and, and uh, we've discussed the projects that are in the pipeline. We will have trees along that portion of the waterfront. We will have trees off from 4th to 11th in that project. It's a multi-million dollar project for not just greening that part of the waterfront, but also making it safe for bicyclists and pedestrians as well. Because right now we're not there yet, so that's another priority. And through to the mono. So just know that as your mayor, you have my support. I'm with you not just in solidarity, but in substance as well. So anything I can do for you, I'm at your service. And uh, thank you. Keep up the great work. And let's keep up the momentum.